mandarine, two tomatoes, two berries, and a something. to represent the sun. But the sun takes up more space than a million Earths. Mercury! It's the smallest planet in our solar system and is the closest to our sun. With our fruit solar system, it would go here. Mercury can get hotter than 400 degrees! But deep within its crater, there are places that never see sunlight. We think there is ice. Venus has a thick toxic atmosphere of carbon dioxide, clouds of acid and more volcanoes than anywhere in the solar system. It is the hottest and brightest planet in our solar system. The deadly atmosphere traps heat and reflects the sunlight. Venus is the second planet away from the sun and it is a similar size to Earth. It would go here. Earth! Call Earth a Goldilocks planet. It's not too hot, not too cold, and the amount of water is just right. It's the only planet certain to contain life. Rawr! Earth would go here. Mars! Mars is a hostile desert. Iron oxide makes the sun red. We have robots exploring Mars called Spirit and Opportunity. It will be very expensive to send people there because the atmosphere is very thin. The sun causes violent dust storms which cover the whole planet. We cannot breathe the air and the nights are very cold. We can still see marks on the surface where water used to be. The four planets closest to the sun are called terrestrial planets. Next we have the gas giants. Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus and Neptune. Sometimes people call Uranus and Neptune the ice giants. The gas giants all have rings. These are made of lots of ice. Jupiter! It's the biggest planet in our solar system. It is two and a half times heavier than all the other planets put together. Coincide the planet is hotter than the surface of the sun. The gas get hot and rises, cools down in the icy atmosphere and forms out. It has a storm bigger than Earth called the Great Red Spot. It has at least 67 moons. One of them is bigger than Mercury. Saturn has the most impressive rings. They are made up of billions of pieces of ice and rocks. They are over 100,000 miles wide, but only as thick as a football field. The amount of hydrogen makes Saturn so light that it will float in the giant bathtub. Uranus! Uranus is the coldest planet. It spins on its side. It was probably knocked over in a collision. Or maybe it's used to have a really heavy moon, eventually stolen by another planet's gravity. Neptune! It's the smallest gas giant. It has only completed one orbit since it was discovered. Methane gets hot inside the planet and crushed in the pressure of the atmosphere. There might be rain on Neptune made of solid diamonds. 